Hey everyone, welcome to another pour video. Um, today's video is basically me playing with paint. Um, I didn't have any real uh, plan today. Uh, it was mainly just uh, my plan was to have fun with it and play around and see what I could make um, and not worry too much about the outcome. Um, I think that my previous paintings, I was a little too worried about the outcome of it. I was, uh, I felt like I had a lot of pressure. Um, I put pressure on myself basically to uh, make a good painting and it just, it took all the fun out of painting for me. Um, so I put a little pin in the pendulum idea and I uh, decided that I was going to just spin my painting and play around with the ribbon and have some fun. So I made myself a little plastic pit so I could uh, spin as hard as I uh, wanted. Um, I think that next time I'm going to secure my painting to the Lazy Susan instead of uh, just kind of placing it precariously on there. Um, my spinning was a little bit... Uh, muted because I was worried that the canvas is going to fly off the Lazy Susan and create a big mess and ruin my painting, basically. So, um, that's about it. I just uh, threw a whole bunch of colors on there and I started spinning away. Um, I put silicone in some of the colors, but not all of the colors. I think that, uh, I mean, I wanted some cells, but I didn't want the entire thing to be full of cells. Um, I don't know. I, I was just looking for some variety. Anyways, so I spent quite a bit of time uh, spinning my canvas. Um, <laughs> as per usual, um, the video is really sped up. I mean, I probably spent a good 20 minutes just uh, spinning the canvas around. Um, this is mainly due to the fact that, you know, although it looks like it's going super fast here, um, keep in mind that it's on uh, probably four times the speed and it kind of took a little bit of momentum to get the paint going to where I wanted it to be. Um, so I decided that I was done with the spinning at this point and I was going to do an, a little ribbon, um, just pouring it out uh, from my hand. Um, I kind of like having the, a little bit more control and I find that I get a bit of a nicer result. So after I laid out this ribbon, which I really liked by the way, um, I decided that uh, composition wise there is uh, something lacking. I felt like I kind of needed to like bring the two elements together somewhat. So. I, I contemplated for quite some time on what I was going to do with this. Um, I just uh, giving it some cursory spins while I thought. And then I decided that if I had some sort of element that kind of just went through both of them, right through the middle, that would totally just uh, make the painting what I wanted it to be. So I. Uh, got a little palette brush and I just uh, swooped it right down the middle. I didn't really know what to expect. Uh, it was kind of nerve-wracking because at this point I really liked the painting. Um, this swoop down the middle it created some really awesome cells, especially uh, through the ribbon. And uh, it, it created quite a trough, so I just uh, filled it up with white paint and decided to call it a day. And uh, this is one of those paintings where I knew right off the bat um, what I was going to call it. I'm calling it Lifeline uh, because really I think that it kind of brought back my love of this painting, um, this type of painting. And I really like it a lot. So I think I'm actually going to try and sell this one. I'm going to, as soon as it dries, I'm going to stick it up on my website and it will be available for sale. Um, so I can afford to buy more of these uh, gallery wrap canvases. So anyways, here's a close up. Um, you can see that uh, the cells here are pretty cool. Um, 
as time went on, like probably another 20 minutes or so, uh, these cells actually uh, got more defined and uh, more interesting looking. So overall, I'm super happy with this painting. Um, I had a lot of fun making it and I hope you had a good time watching the video. If you did, remember to hit like and make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit that bell button for notifications for when I post new videos. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day. Bye.